All that matters is what you are thinking when it comes to consciously manifesting what you want. And I just got back from my walk. Whenever I'm on my walk, I always think about things that I want to talk to you guys about. So before consciously manifesting what you want, I'm sure there were times where you wanted to seek external validation to let you know that you are good enough, that you are loved, that you are wanted. You needed that approval from them to let you know these things. But everybody is always mirroring back to you what you think about you. And I had a friend the other day come up to me and say, Steph, do you really think that I'd be good enough to do that? And I said to them, because they know that I teach conscious manifestation, I said, all that matters is what you think. That's coming from your self-concept of not feeling good enough to do that certain thing. So you're looking to me to validate you that you are good enough. Of course you can do it, but all that matters is what you think about it, that you feel that you can do that. This is why self-concept is so important because so many times we are going to seek external validation from others if we have a low self-concept that, you know what, if they come back, then I'll feel loved. If they call me, then I'm going to feel wanted. No, they are always mirroring back your dominant beliefs, thoughts, and assumptions. So all that matters is what you think about you. So you need to start waking up every single day knowing that you are the prize, knowing that you are a priority, knowing that you are loved. And when you start seeing yourself this way, everybody in your reality will start mirroring how you see yourself. And not only that, start having positive assumptions about everyone in your reality because they are always thinking whatever you think they're thinking. So if you believe that that person wants nothing to do with you, that they could care less about you, then they are going to pick up on that because they are reflecting your consciousness and you will see an unfavorable version of them. So start thinking positive assumptions about yourself and others in your reality. And everyone will always be reflecting you. Follow me for more tips.